it can be so frustrating when life feels like it's absolutely out of control. If I could share with you something that would change your life, that is absolutely revolutionary, revolutionized, excuse me, the way that I live my life and help me reach success in all areas of my life, would you be interested? Well, today we're going to talk about patterns and the power of patterns on the negative side and the positive side. So if you're interested in changing your life through patterns, you're going to want to watch this video. Hey, what's up guys? Coach JV from 3T Fitness. Do us a huge favor. Hit that subscribe button. Also hit the like button. And right down here, hit the notification button. That way you can be alerted on all our videos. Also, if you want to see something on this YouTube channel, leave it down in the comments below. We may just do your video. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Coach JV, the CEO of 3T Fitness, 3T Warrior Labs, and soon 3T Consulting, a consulting company that helps fitness companies and any company alike learn how to build a legacy company not just a company but one that's going to last a lifetime so today you are interested in learning about patterns if you're watching this video but do me a huge favor watch all the way through and at the end i got a challenge for you to leave something in the comments below so check this out so one of the things that's very important in life is patterns but let's talk a little bit deeper in regards to why are patterns important why is a pattern important you have to understand deep inside how the brain works. And once you start to understand how the brain works, you become powerful beyond measure. Now this computer that's sitting in front of me right here is not even close to as powerful as a supercomputer we have within our head. So let's break it down. So you have, let's picture like a, a circle, right? So on the top of the circle, you have 5%, which is your conscious mind. Your conscious mind right now is taking in the information that I'm talking about right now. It is analyzing what I'm saying, it's your short-term memory, and it's analyzing it based on your subconscious mind programming since when you were a young child. Then you have your 95% beautiful, wide open subconscious mind. This subconscious mind is your connection to your higher self, your intuition, your emotions, your emotions. That's why you get the gut feeling. Your conscious mind takes in information, it responds based on subconscious mind programming, and it creates a feeling and vibration within your body. Now that we understand that our subconscious mind creates a vibration and a feeling within our body, this is where patterns come into play. The average human has 70,000 thoughts a day, 70,000 thoughts a day. Now here's the trick. Most of those thoughts are from the day before. Unfortunately, most of the thoughts are negative. Our brain works in a negative fashion for protection. I, I believe it's for protection, that primal instinct, right? If somebody comes running up on you on the streets, you're not gonna be like, hey, you give them a big old hug like I do. You're probably gonna be like, whoa, what's going on? Your mind is automatically thinking opposite of optimism to protect yourself, right? So knowing that and knowing the power of the brain, why are patterns important? Think about what I just said. The average human has 70,000 thoughts a day. Most of the thoughts are from the day before and most of the thoughts are negative. So if your thoughts are from the day before, why do you keep having the same thoughts over and over and over again? Because you're following patterns. Let me repeat that. The reason why you have the same thoughts over and over again is because you're following patterns. You wake up on the same side of the bed, you scroll on Instagram and Facebook, you look at your ex's social media feed, you, you do the same thing, you get angry once again, you go grab the same cup of coffee that says best mom, best dad in the world, you fill up your cup of coffee, you get in the car at the exact same time, you stop at the exact same light, you get frustrated because you missed the light, then you pass the same light pole where you have the same thought, you get to the same work and you go to the same water cool and you talk the crap about the same people, and then you go to your desk and you stare at your computer, you check your emails and you look at your watch until lunch, and what's happened is you're doing the same pattern over and over and over again. And then as you're driving home, you're thinking about how great your uh, interaction with your spouse is gonna be and how you're gonna hug them and they're gonna give you flowers and you have this thought in your head, this expectation, and when you walk in, they're in a bad mood and then you get pissed and then the same pattern happens over and over and over again. So I just explained to you most people's life. And if patterns and thoughts are so important, then what if you started to shift your patterns? What if you started to change the time you woke up? What if you started to change the fact that you're scrolling on Instagram and Facebook? Would you agree that you would have new neurons firing within your brain, new neuroplasticity, new growth within your brain to create new success? I stopped for just a moment because I wanted to slow down and help you understand that. Here's what you need to do. Pattern stacking, habit stacking. 
So what you wanna do is change one simple pattern. Change one simple pattern. Imagine a world, I just did it this year. Let me explain really quickly. Imagine a world if you started waking up a little bit earlier. You now shifted a pattern. So I was used to waking up at 3.10 every morning. Now people kept telling me, JB, you need more sleep. 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 So guess what? I finally gave into the hype and I started sleeping more in January. That was my thing. Some of you may watch that video. It's like, oh, I'm gonna start sleeping more in January. Well, I started to sleep for an hour more in January and guess what happened? Completely disrupted my patterns. I started to want to sleep more and more. I got lazier and lazier. I needed caffeine in the afternoon to keep going in my 19 hour day. So what happened was I disrupted my pattern. It created negative thoughts within my head and it started to spin. I had the worst January I've had in a long time. So what I did is I went back to my old pattern, but I also changed it. Because for 13 years, I've woken up at 3.10 in the morning. So now I wake up at 2.50 in the morning. I'm at the gym by 3.10 and that positive pattern change has completely revolutionized and catapulted my success. Because I changed the pattern, I changed the, the behavior, I fired off new neurons in my brain, I increased neuroplasticity, my body had to adjust to a new positive pattern, and that new positive pattern manifested in great activities and behaviors, and by, by the time most people had woken up, I've done more work than most people do in a whole week by nine o'clock in the morning. This video was being filmed at 6.24 in the morning. I've already done a YouTube video last night. We're doing a YouTube video right now. Kev is with me right now recording the day in the life. We've done more by 624 in the morning than most people do. I'm not telling you to wake up super early. What I'm telling you to do is understand the brain and how it works. And if you want to reach success in your health, your, uh, your wealth, your relationship, you have to change the pattern. Unless you like what you're getting out of your life. If you don't like what you're getting, then change the pattern. Stick with the pattern for a while. Don't throw the kitchen sink at it. Don't wake up early, get new gym clothes, drink a gallon of water, do one thing. Just do one thing, just wake up earlier. Wake up early and drink 16 ounces of water. Just start there. Or maybe wake up early and stop scrolling through Instagram, Facebook, put a book right next to your toilet. We all go pee when we wake up, right? Get a book and sit there and read a page of a book. Don't scroll through Instagram or Facebook. You're messing with your neuroplasticity. Get a different cup of coffee. Maybe don't drink coffee. Grab Warrior Burn. Hint, hint. <laughs> Stay till the end of the video. I got something for you. But hey, check this out. So this is what I want you to do today. I want you to change one pattern. Do me a huge favor, change one pattern. Now we're gonna start to continue to talk about neuroplasticity and the brain and how it works and how it goes into health and fitness. And we're gonna take you on a full journey in 3T Fitness, educational videos, day in the life, health and fitness, just really getting down to understanding how humans work. I believe that as humans, we're supposed to evolve. We got different fingerprints, different DNA, and I don't think for one minute we came here just to exist. So I'm proud of you for making it all the way to the end. So I got a challenge for you. So what I want you to do is I want you to comment below. What pattern are you going to change? What pattern are you going to change? And what I want to do is if you put your comments below, we're going to take all the comments and we're going to pick one person. We'll do it live here on, on YouTube and we're gonna send you a free bottle of Warrior Burn. So comment below, like, comment, put the comment of the pattern you're gonna change. What we will do is we'll take all the names, we will pick one name live on YouTube and we will send you a free bottle of Warrior Burn. So you're gonna help us out by leaving a comment, letting YouTube know we're doing a good job, and we're gonna reward you for that. My name is Coach JV, I am the top health and mindset coach in the world. What you believe in your heart, you think in your mind will eventually become your words and become your reality. Oh, hey, you guys are still here. Well, since you're here, you may as well click on this video right here or maybe this video right here. Hey, you may as well subscribe. We'll see you on the other side.